Are you loving it? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> the third characteristics of a change of season. That means what to look forward to, expect what to anticipate. The things that are hap- the things that happen when season changes is that when season changes, you become super productive. You become fruitful. You bear fruit. You have positive results. You have results of great accomplishments. That's the, the thing that indicates a change of season. You are never the same. Yeah, season doesn't leave you the same. God's season doesn't leave you the same. You, you have change of seasons. The Bible says in Psalm 1 and verse 1 to 3, Blessed is the man, the woman, the boy, the girl, that walketh not in the counsel of the ungodly, nor standeth in the ways of the sinner, nor seated in the seat of this comfort. He said, but his delight is in the law of the Lord. On, on his law does he or her meditate day and night. He shall be like a tree planted by the rivers of water. That does what? That bringeth forth his fruit in his season. So in your season, you're going to have fruits. You're going to have productivity. You're going to have results. You're going to have great accomplishment. So this is my season. This is my season. So the season is changing so that you can become super productive. You can have positive results. You can have accomplishment. In your season, you become productive. So season bring about productivity. Hallelujah. Because some people don't know how to maximize their season. You are getting this revelation that when the season changes, yeah, <laughs> yeah it's to bring productivity into your life. But also watch the, 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 the kind of uh, admonition he gave us there. Make sure you don't walk in the counsel of the ungodly. Don't stand in the way of the sinners. Don't sit with discomfort. Don't sit with mockers of the things of God. Don't join people to mock what God is doing in the season. Delight yourself in the law of the law, in the words of God, in the ways of God. Get excited. That's how to maximize your season because when you do that, you shall be like a tree that is planted by the rivers of water, are you going to begin to be productive in your season? You will bring forth fruits. Yeah. Hallelujah. And it says, whatsoever you do shall prosper. Hallelujah. That means you will succeed. Amen. You will excel Amen. in your career, Amen. in your business. Amen. Your business will sail. Amen. Your vocation will sail. Amen. And you're going to excel in the name of Jesus Christ Amen. in your season. You will excel. Begin to excel in the name of Jesus Christ. Begin to become productive. Begin to have results. Begin to be fruitful. Yeah, it's a fruitful season. Hallelujah. <laughs> God gives us fruitful season, brings fruit. He has not left himself without a witness. He gives us fruitful season. Someone say fruitful season. Say, I shall be fruitful. I will be productive. Say, this is my season. Say, I will excel. I will do well. In the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. 